Hello and welcome to World Cup 2014 in 1998 in France, which is in Rio de Janeiro in Brasilia. Oh yes, that is a lot of information for you all to take in. Brazil are looking like the favourites for taking this competition by storm. 3-2 against Sweden to put them straight into the quarter-final. England also against Colombia. That match coming up next. Can they get through to then maybe take on the Netherlands? So let's go over there now. Uh, here we are at Leon. England again classed as the home team, obviously because they smashed their last opponent, Mexico 3-1. Oh, uh, yeah. Also, today, Netherlands beat Denmark 2-1. I've been told that I have to calm down my accent a bit and go a bit dimcher. No, that's not right. Uh, fuck. <laughs> I've forgotten what voice I was doing. Cockney shit. I don't even remember how to do it. Uh, hang on, let me try. Hello there, my friends. What? No, that's not it. I literally have forgotten how to do the accent. Uh, anyway, random person has died. Um, from now on, it will be Country Bumpkin doing the intros. Hello, my lovers. Welcome to England versus Columbia. I'm Country Bumpkin. Er, random person. He's gone on holiday, yes? So this is me, Country Bumpkin, doing the introductions to these lovely videos for Super Grumpy Tom. England, Columbia, coming up soon. I'll land you over now. And Lula Loader. To the bad of you. Oh, one more thing. Before I forget. Do, 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 do. Player names. Fucking on, dumbass. There we go. Oh, if you guessed right, well done. If you guessed wrong, well done anyway, because I'm a thick idiot and I probably would have forgotten. Uh, let's get on with the match, shall we? I'll try and remember how I did that voice before. To uh, pardon me, sorry. Here in France, and we'll it was like, to John Welcome, my skanks, to. That was it! Oh, you fucking idiot. <laughs> I, fog I totally today. forgot. I'll do I'll do a, a piece next time uh, with. Well, at the end of this one, I'll do Country Bumpkin. Uh, and the next time, random person will come back off of holiday. Oh, you there, you skanks! What have you been fucking up to? You've been shagging my missus! Like that sort of thing. Anyway, England, Colombia. Don't know anything about Colombia. This is going to be a very uninteresting video because I don't have a clue what's going on. Uh, nice flag, though. Very nice. Lovely colours. Beautiful. A bit like Brazil, the colours of the strip. Uh, I love how the, the socks are red. Uh, the it's basically the colour of the flag on their uniform. That's lush. The trouble with England uniform, uh, England uniform, in England flag, it's basically just red and white. Uh, you can't really do a lot of design choices with it, but... Fucking yes. Oh. Damn it. The button sometimes just doesn't want to do it. You have to really just be calm, but sometimes you just want to whack the button as hard as you can. Uh, fuck! Get the ball, get the ball. We can't be taken down by Columbia. Jesus Christ. Go, 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 go. Go. Go more. Go faster. <gasps> Shira! 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 Go, go, go! Nice. Well done, Shears. Yes! Goal number one! We are the champions. We're gonna win this fucking thing. A pretty fucking close. Let's just be pause. Be pause. Be pause. <gasps> so, Country Pumpkin, what do you think? Well, my lover, I thought it was a lovely goal. Make you low in there. He's fucking brilliant, isn't he? He's been lovely all tournament. He's been doing well for these boys. Oh, we like him down here in Dempture. We think he's fucking marvellous down here. He's lovely. He's a he, lovely lad as well. We met him. He fought, he brought us all around and then he took us down fucking down the country lanes. Thanks, Country Bumpkin. Uh, he, sorry, he cut out there. We had to cut him off. He was doing my own head in rather than anyone else's. What did I press then? I don't know. 1 0. Game on. Come on, Columbia. Put up a fight. We don't want to be make this easy. Oh, Owen is on fire. Shoot! Oh, oh. Uh, oh, I'm very sorry. I've had, well, probably two pints of beer so far. Uh, I'm getting a little bit drunk and a little bit rowdy. Sat here on my couch. Shoot! Ah, oh, nuts! Shoot! <gasps> Paul Lentz, man, he scores those cracking goals. No other player on this team seems to be able to just score an absolute cracker. Uh, last time. Alan Shearer scored an amazing... That was a through ball. He ran onto it, passed about three players, 
slot it into the goal. That was beautiful, but that one was class as well. Like bottom corner. Let's see that again. Loads of players around him. Oh, turn and kick. So oh, beautiful. Two, beautiful. You're way too beautiful, team. That's why we win the World Cup. You'll have me suicidal, suicidal when we go out on penalties again and again and again. Superb. Lovely. There we go. 3 0. This game piss a piss. Hopefully, we'll get a better opponent next time. Uh, hopefully, some. Oh, no, it won't be. It'll be the Netherlande. Netherlande. Uh, the Netherlands, probably. Yeah, lovely. The Netherlands. 3 0. Beautiful. John Watson said it. It is John Watson, by the way, doing the commentary. I think he still does the commentary on the football. Don't quote me on that, though, because I don't actually know or care. Go, go, go. Go, go, power. Oh, Shearer, you beast. Two goals for Shearer. One goal for Ince. One goal for Owen. Love it. So the three top players of the competition, basically, have all scored in this match. Fucking awesome. I need beer. Oh, I'm getting a bit drunk. I'm going to start slurring. Oh, more than usual, should I say. I slur anyway. Mm. Fucking beautiful. I'm sorry if I've sworn quite a lot during this series. Um, trying to tame it down. It's difficult, though. Um, if you don't like it, don't watch it. Simples. <gasps> oh, that was close. God damn it. F Mondragon. Never heard of him. They're all real players, though. That's the great thing about the FIFA uh, nowadays, is it's got all the players, it's got all the teams. Oh, so close. So it's fully licensed, which is great. Uh, back in the day, the first FIFA International Soccer, it was all made up player names. Stuff like Webster and stuff like... I remember on the Game Boy, it was some really just random English names. Um, which is fine. Um, and it worked. The game was great anyway, but it just adds a bit more authenticity to it. You feel like you're, you're actually playing... You know the actual World Cup, rather than just oh, an amalgamation of it, well amalgamation, um, uh, animal magic of it. So it's class. Holy it's holy great. Holy oh, man. lovely. Uh, they have got a bit of a monopoly on it though, which is a shame. It means that nobody else can really take it to them. Uh, Plo, Plo Evolution Smlockler, uh, pardon me, in recent years has got a bit more uh, licensing, so they can do a bit, few more things. But still, it's. Uh, that game sucks now as well, by the way. It was really good. I never really liked it, but apparently... Oh, shit balls. Off the bloody post. 4-0 to what's gonna be the champions. 4-0 to what's gonna be the champions. Through ball and a beautiful shot, but he missed. And F Mondragon will have to go and get the ball from the person who took it from the crowd. Half time, thank god. Time. Running out of four, fucking nil. breath there. I'm gonna have a quick drink. <laughs> I'm getting slightly pissed. It's great, but there's there's only what, three more two more episodes to go over this, so I'll be fine, I can get through that. Mm -mm -mm. Ah, lovely. There's a customer care line on the bloody beer bottle. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm a bit drunk. Can you come and help me get to hospital please? Um Okay, which country scored the quickest ever World Cup qualifying goal against England? Let's go for San Marino. It's probably wrong. Who cares? Second half, Alan Shearer to kick off. Man of the tournament so far, definitely. Even though he got sent off against some events. France it was, he got sent off against. Fuck! Give me the ball. Twat, give me the ball. Twat, give me the ball. Thank you. Twat. Twat. Oi! Give me the twatting ball! Ah, oh. oh, beautiful. Three ball. Run, 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 on its uh, default setting, it's in, fucking mad. But you put it up and it's like, bloody hell, it's just like end-to-end. -end. It's fun. Uh, but no, it's not what football's about. Football is about precision and and build-up and 
and uh, sponsorship. Sorry, I don't know what I'm talking about. Lost it. Lost the plot. I think I've had a bit too much beer. <laughs> it tastes so good. I just really fancied beer today. Um, I knew I had to record this. Well, I didn't have to record this today. I had plenty of time to do it, but I just wanted to do it. <gasps> that was close. I just wanted to do it today. Um, I've been putting it off for a couple of days, so I just had to really sit down and record this shit. This shizzle. But it's so much fun. It's a great, great game. I love playing it. I absolutely love it. It's a shame I'm probably never going to play it again, to be honest, because I just don't have the time. So it's great. That's what I, that's what I love about having a YouTube channel, is... I'm, this is this is for fun, really. I'm not really worried about um, it getting popular. I'd like it to be popular, but I'm not worried about making money from it. That's not what this is about. This is like a this is a labour of love. This is about getting people to appreciate uh, the games that are out there that possibly haven't had the um, exposure that they deserve. I mean, this obviously has got plenty of let but other games I don't think people have heard of, like Res is a big one. I'm sure most gamers have heard of it, but whether they've actually played it or not, I don't know, because a Dreamcast is a... It's quite a, a, a weird console to own. Not a lot of people really talk about it. Um, which is a shame, because it's, it's the one of the best consoles ever made. Especially for the games. The games are just cracking. So, yeah, I love doing this channel. I get to play the games that I haven't... I've forgotten about, or haven't played in a while, or... Oh, walked into the goal. Beautiful hat trick. Beautiful hat trick. Oh, that's not his thingy. No, that's not Alan Shearer's celebration, which is a shame. He just puts his arm up in the air and then runs around like a nutter with a smile on his face, which is class, really. It's boring, but it's very him, I think. So, yeah, um, yeah, I get to play the games that I don't play normally, which is always nice. Um, I will get through everything in my collection, and then I'll have to start buying extra games. I've got freaking tons of games, though, so that's not going to happen anytime soon. It's going to take years before I'm through my games. I've got a box of the stuff that I've done. Um, there's only about 20 boxes in there, which sounds like nothing, but it looks more than I can remember. Here we go again. Oh, I was just going to walk it in. That's a shame. Damn them. Damn them all to hell. This is Spartars. Um, I watched Frozen the other day. Meh. Don't know what that's got to do with this. Never mind. So, 5-0. Uh, that's pretty much a drubbing of Colombia. Uh, I was hoping for a better opponent. It's a shame that some, there aren't some better teams in this draw. But never mind. We live and learn. Oh, come Oh, look at that. Michael Owen. Which looks nothing like Michael Owen. Now, this game, I think the players are all the same height. Uh, it looks that way. In FIFA 99, they finally got around to chain the, changing the players' heights. Uh, and they match real life players and it adds an extra dimension to the gameplay because um, so going for a header the taller person will normally win the ball uh, stuff like that and they just, they just look a bit more it looks a bit more realistic whereas this it just looks like it looks still like a video game um, whereas FIFA 99 is starting to look like imitation of real life it's beautiful visuals um, I think I will do a, a Road to World Cup on it probably or if I already have Ignore what I just said, because <laughs> everything's out of order. Because that's what I like that's doing, is confusing the shit out of Oh, come on, confusing the shit out of everyone. Don't you like being confused? I love being confused. I love like, not knowing what's going on, which happens a lot. Anyway, end of the game. 6-0 to the champions. Can we win the World Cup? There's two more matches to go. The semis in the final. I think we've got Netherlands. Eh? Sorry, Netherlands in the final. And then probably Brazil if we get that far. Um, but now I'm going to hand you over to Country Bumpkin because random person is on holiday just for today. So uh, Country Bumpkin, your analysis, please. Well, hello, my lover. Thank you for letting me come here today in, in, instead of that foul-mouthed person who comes here and spouts his nonsense. So I can have a talk to you about farming, I will. See this pitch down here? It'd be lovely. Oh, it was San Marino. Well done, Super Grumpy Tom. You did well. So, yeah, it was a um, lovely pitch. We could grow some serious crops on this pitch. But the trouble is, it'd be for freaking football. Anyway, I, enough of me. I'm rubbish. Uh, tune in next time for the semi-finals. Let's have a go now. We'll show you the table. Uh, continue, please. 
See, we are my friends. Oh, God, I've just totally lost the accent. That's all. <laughs> we, oh, Christ, playing Brazil in the semis. Shit. So we'll play Romania in the final if we get there. But I think England-Brazil is going to be the toughest match. Uh, we'll get that next time. And possibly Random Burson will be back. Maybe. So thank you for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.